Hey guys, this is Advanced Logic. Welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario. In the last part, we made it back into Goomba Village, and now we have Goombario in our party. Oh god! Who's this? Ah! Oh wait, that's Goombario. Never mind. I thought it was an enemy. And this part, we're gonna be confronting the Goomba King. Of course. Kind of an underwhelming fortress, though. <laughs> King Goomba, help us! Mario beat us up! Did he say beats us up? Mario beats us up? I'm not sure if I read that right. Ooh, a tree. I must hit it. Hey, look, Mario, see that building over there? What building? I'm pretty sure there used to be a bridge on that other side. I wonder what happened to it. What the hell? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, that is one cross eyed escape. <laughs> So, Mario, it's true you've made it this far. I respect you for that. Unfortunately, this is as far as you'll ever get. Yes, he has a fancy accent. Because I, the great and powerful King Goomba, will see to it that you advance no farther. You are awesome. <laughs> you hear that, Mario? Not further, not one step. Are you scared, little man? Bah! Yeah, you're scared, alright. You wanna say you're sorry? No, not really. Wow, that King Goomba is really huge! <laughs> I'm sure he's no match for you though, Mario. Let's get him. Let's get him, brother. Ready to meet my wrath, Mario? You'd better be. Because I have a fancy accent. And I kind of sound like Ignignaut. Beat him up, King Goomba. We've got your back. <laughs> no, you don't. Leave him to me. Hey, Mario. I think maybe we ought to take out the Goomba brothers first, don't you think? It might be pretty weak since we just finished beating him up back there. And yep. And don't take him on directly, though. Go for the tree! Fuck the tree! Bam, bam, and bam. Yay. Saves you trouble. So anyway, this is the King Goomba. Let's get his info. This is the Goomba King. He's really big. I mean, look at him. He looks really powerful. Actually, tree 10. Attack power 1, defense 0. Boss of the Red Goomba and Blue Goomba. Who cares if he's strong? You're much stronger. Yeah, I wonder if he take. What do you hate to become so big? I like to be a bit bigger too. <laughs> oh god, the innuendos. So easy to make. And. Ow. You fucking bastard. What did I ever do to you other than kill your minions? Take this. Ah. And yes, I'm being a cheap bastard. I'm using the freaking power jump. They gave you it for a reason. If you call me cheap for using it, well, why would they give it to you in the first place? Ah! Well, that was easy. That was pathetically easy. And now we've got enough for a level up. Yeah. And it recovered your HP and FP. So, what to raise, what to raise. So many options. Ah, screw it, HP. What, what? How could I lose? Your fancy accent does nothing, you bastard. Yeah, I knew we could do it. Cool, victory. All right. So, what the hell do we do from here? Hit the tree. And we get a star piece. All right. Very nice. Trust me, you're going to want a lot of those. Maybe. Possibly. What the hell? The fuck? Hey, what up, buddies? You tell me what this is about? Red Goomba, you're positive that you hit the switch well, right? Of course, King Goomba. Hit it in the grass inside the fortress. Outside the... You idiot! You didn't hide it in here. Mario will find it for sure. Oh, do you think? You know, you might be right. King Goomba, maybe we ought to challenge Mario before he tries to. Uh, no. Bam! Uh, Mario, good fight and all that. I must warn you, however. If you happen to find a strange switch somewhere, you should definitely not press it. It's dangerous, understand? You what? You already pressed it! Oh, no! Oh, no! You know, you really sh you guys suck at hiding this sort of shit. Anyway! <laughs> I like how the windows were just like glued on and shit. And yeah. <laughs> Boing. Bam. We sure kicked his ass. Look, the bridge! Now we can cross it and continue our journey. Alright. Alright indeed, Goombario. I wonder if there's anything hidden here. I doubt there is. 
Alright, so let's keep going. Now we're finished with the prologue, I believe. So let's hit this coin. Go for every coin you possibly can. Even though I'm a greedy bastard and I'll probably never use them. Damn right, I'll save. Mighty King Bowser, I've been looking for you. I report your evilness. Mario defeated the Goomba King. He's heading for Toad Town now. I gotta start deciding on how the fuck to make my voice. What? Unbelievable! Was that King? That was King Woo Goom that was What was Goomba King? Da da da! I fuck it! I used the star out to make him a king because he begged me! And Mario whips him so easily? What a wimp! And I sound like. No, I sound like Randy Savage! Um, Gabby Goomba, you are sure that Mario can never defeat us, right? Please, please, your violinist, try to be calm. Goomba King is small time. I had a feeling he'd fail. It doesn't matter, because while you hold the Star Rod, you are definitely invincible. You could be Mario with one claw right behind your back. Then why didn't he do it? Yes, yes, very good. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Okay, now I'm starting to get the voice back. By the way, Kami Koopa, those Star Spirits we captured didn't have any way of giving Mario their power, did they? Please don't worry yourself. Each is held separately. And each is carefully guarded by your hand-picked subjects. Even Mario can't save all seven of the Star Spirits. Hmm... Who's the closest star spirit tomorrow? Is that the one at Koopa Brothers Fortress, right? Thank you for that, Bowser, you jackass. Fourth wall everywhere in this bitch. If, if Mario somehow reaches there, you, can the Koopa Brothers defeat him? Ugh. I cannot keep a constant voice! King Bowser, you mustn't worry. Hiya! Oh my god! What the fuck are these? Here come the Koopa Brothers! Uh huh, oh yeah, we're the coolest to coo. Psst, Gamma Cooper, are you sure these guys can get the job done? That Goomba King was gigantic, but even he can beat Mario. Pshaw, get real, King Bowser. Yeah, the Goomba King was huge, but he was a total wimpola. There were nothing like him. See, what you got going on is the power of teamwork. Together, we can put the herd of Mario in seconds flat. Excellent, that's the spirit. Sell it, Koopa Brothers. Show our king that special attack you do so well. Yes, ma'am. Ready, everybody? Oh. Oh! An orgy! <laughs> that is... Oh! <laughs> How'd you like it? King Bowser, how was it? Oh, yeah. Excellent. Really? I'm not easily impressed, either. Mario won't have a chance if you finish him with that attack. We'll take him, King Bowser. By the way, Cooper Brothers, about the Captain Star Spirit and locked up in your fortress. Who's guarding him right now? Uh, nobody, sir. No, we're here, and so... You idiots! Use your heads! Get back to the fortress and guard that Star Spirit! No. Alright, fine. Alright, so, we're making some pretty good progress now. We're kicking some ass. Kicking ass, taking ass. Oh wait, I don't think I played that right. And a sleepy sheep. And if it works, it'll make enemies fall asleep for a little bit. Maybe. Anyway, fuck this. Yeah, spring! Alright, so we found a chest up here. What might it have? The hammer thrower badge. Hits one enemy with a hammer no matter where the enemy is. So I guess with this we could hit enemies in the air. I think it might cost 2 FP as a result. I think, yep, it costs 2 FP, so we're gonna have to unequip one of those. Ah, screw it. Not worth it, in my opinion. We can just jump on them. You know, unless they have spikes on their heads. Mario, I'm so glad you're okay. Why do they always pause when they say glad? The town is in an uproar. The, kin the princess kidnapped the very castle uprooted. It's Bedlam. What the fuck is Bedlam? I really don't know what we can do about this. Please, Mario, save her highness. Yeah, screw you all. I'm going home. Hey, Luigi! I wonder what my brother Mario is doing right now. Conveniently, I'm coming! 
Not in that way, though. Whoa, Mario, it's you! Good to see you! And you're alright! After all that castle craziness, I was really worried about you. I ran outside just as the earthquake started, so I managed to escape in time. You coward! <laughs> huh? Who are you? I'm hey, Mario, nice to meet you. I see. Great, just great. You're on an exciting adventure with Mario. Talk about unfair. See, someone has to look after this house and I can't, so I can't leave. Oh well, take care of Mario, okay? Trust me, Luigi, if I could do the Mario, the rest of the Mario and Luigi series, I would. You deserve to be in more Let's Plays, man! So, anyway, let's just check around here. Peace. You're while you're a pink, you're a pink string, you still want to go to bed? Nah, good. Anyway, if you push up so you can actually check the status of your stuff, like HP, FP, and all that good stuff, here's the box where letters are just to Mario go. It's empty right now. Anything in here? No. And there's like a little board right here. Looks a little off compared to the rest of them. And what's this? Oh yeah, and this gives you info on everything you can get in this game. So we have current 36 coins, badges collected 3 out of 80, star pieces collected 3 out of 160. Oh yeah, I have a while to go. Number of battles 15, first strike 0, enemies first strike 0. Their my first strikes are 10. And enemies have zero first strikes on me. Feels nice. Feels very nice. And let's check this right here. I'm making sure I'm not missing anything. Nothing in there. So yeah, there's 160 star pieces and I'm definitely not going for 100% in this game. Well, maybe. I might. Maybe. I've not done a practice run of this game, so though, so I can't really make any promises there. So let's make our way over to the Shooting Star Summit, I guess. What the what is this? Above us on the top floor, there is a dojo. We are here, always training at the dojo. Unless our master isn't here, in which case the dojo is closed. The letter just arrived, saying the master will return soon. We will train again soon. All right, that's nice. So let's make our way over here. The cows, the freaking castle. Castle! Let's go! <laughs> I still don't get how the hell Bowser got under there, though. I can't believe that Princess Peach's castle was here just a little while ago. Wow! It was in the castle when it started to shake, and my lightning quick feet got me out. You too are a coward! I know Luigi made it along with me and a few others. Everyone else was taken. Huh, well, that sucks for them. Alright, so onward to Shooting Star Summit and all that good stuff. And here's where I like the music. I don't know why. Ooh. Oh shit. It's calming in a way. Yes, Shooting Star Summit. Of course. Let us go. Onward to where it's intended for us to go. Seriously, I love this music. It sounds so mystical and all that good stuff. I don't think there's any enemies we're going to be encountering right now, so I think we're pretty good, and damn it Mario, I'm pushing the control stick as hard as I can, and you're not working with me here. Hey, look at that! What up, buddy? Welcome, Mario. You, we've been waiting for you. Holy crap. We are the Seven Star Spirit. Our job is to grant the wishes of good people from our home in Star Haven, a place high beyond the sky. We're going to tell you something incredibly important. Please listen carefully. The other day, Bowser and his followers invaded our peaceful Star Haven. They stole our prized treasure, the Star Rod, which we've carried, we're cared for since the beginning of time. The Star Rod is powerful beyond belief. It can grant any wish. For as long as we can remember, Bowser has been making wishes like, for instance, I'd like to trounce Mario, or I want Princess Peach to like me. Ah, pathetic. Nah, I'm kidding. Of course, Stars ignores such selfish, self, nah, selfish wishes. As a result, his wishes were never granted. Bowser, that fiend. When he found out that we were ignoring his wishes, he came and stole the Star Rod so he could grant his own wishes. He seems content right now, mainly because he defeated you and captured the princess. Soon enough, though, I fear he'll wish for more, and when then terrible things would happen. It is the responsibility of the seven Star Spirits to keep the Star Rod safe and use it properly. We must get the Star Rod back from Bowser and return it to its rightful place. In order to do this, Mario, we need your help. Sadly, right now you are not strong enough to challenge Bowser. 
He has made himself all powerful and made by making wishes with the Star Rod. He is terrible to behold. Once we seven Star Spirits are re reunited in Star Haven, we can give you the power to fight Bowser even with his newfound strength. With our help, you can prevail. Nah. Mario, we are. Alas, we've nearly exhausted our power to talk to you. Although it looks like we're right beside you, we're only an illusion. You don't say! We're using all of our strength to communicate with you over a great distance, but even now, our strength is fading. We've been caught in our being held by Bowser's followers in different places throughout the Mushroom Kingdom. Please, Mario, first of all, you must rec rescue us. I keep not talking right! In order to take the Star Rod back from Bowser and save Princess Peach, we need your help. Please, Mario. You are our last hope, and we will. Nah, they're dead. Mario, it looks like things are a lot more serious than I thought. You think the princess is going to be alright? I'm really worried about her. Alright, fine. 